It is the most high octane division in all of WWE. Ladies and gentlemen, the cruiserweights are set. We are ready. It is time for 205 Live. Byron, you always struck me as a regular unleaded kind of guy. The following contest is an Extreme Rules match. Making his way to the ring from Air Scotland. Weighing in at 178 pounds, the Scottish Supernova, Noam Dar. His character issues aside, Byron, you have to respect Noam Dar for what he can do once the bell rings. Oh, there's no denying his skill, but there's also no denying that you simply can't trust the guy. And I'd also like to add that this match will go a long way in determining the pecking order here in WWE. Yeah, and he's hoping his stock continues to rise. A loss here, though, would certainly crush those hopes. And his opponent from Dudley, England. Weighing in at 175 pounds, Tyler Bates. We're now just moments away from what will likely be one of the most brutal matches we've seen in a very long time. That's right, Cole. These matches have a way of turning barbaric, and I suspect this one will be no different. Some are saying he's in the best shape of his career right now. Would you agree with that, Corey? It's hard not to agree with that statement, Cole. I mean, just look at him. I'll tell you, he's going to be tough to beat, that's for sure. There's always one type of match in the WWE that is wilder than wild when things go extreme and the landscape of the WWE changes in unpredictable ways. It's extreme rules. Absolutely, Michael. Rules are out the window in this one. And that means the consequences are huge for every superstar in this match. That's a thing, Byron. Many superstars have had their career derailed by an extreme rules match. But just as many have had their careers launched into the stratosphere. It's only a matter of time until we see which is which. Nothing like extreme rules. It's not looking good for him here. He's got to get out of that corner. With all the destruction, with all the carnage, Byron, is there a key to victory in something like this? There cannot be any hesitation to do what you've got to do. You have to be aggressive and stay on the attack. That's what it's all about. Pull out all the stops, dig down deep, do what you have to do. This takes strength, speed, and innovation. And don't forget about a merciless mean streak. Damn. Beautiful Sambo style. Straight punch. Can he end it quickly? Very curious move to go for a pinfall at this point. That's either sheer genius or complete stupidity, Cole. Oh, nasty impact. He's feeling the effects of that last hit. He planned for this and could still rally. Running knee. They get dangerous out here, especially when there are no countouts. Given how impressive Tyler Bate has been thus far, guys, you almost forget that he's just a kid. If you remember, he first stepped into a WWE ring when he was just 19 years old. There it is. Did you hear that crack? Tyler Bate just too fast for him. As the wrist locked up. Ripcord Larian. Really just laying it in. It's going to be interesting who comes up on top early on in this contest. 
I'll stress further what Michael was saying about Tyler Bates' age. When most 19-year-olds were busy trading barbs with each other on social media, Bate was wowing a global audience in the inaugural United Kingdom Championship Tournament. And since that time, Bate has only gotten better. And it's scary to think of how good this guy is going to be five or ten years from now. Ooh, harsh impact. Big, big back body drop. What elevation. He's taking some good hits. Not everyone's cut out for extreme rules. Maybe he wasn't ready. Real quick reminder, guys. There are no disqualifications and no countouts in this one. Anything is legal. Oh, and there are enough weapons under the ring to fill an armory. Noam Dar gets out of the way quickly. Boom, what impact! Ooh, nasty shot to the throat. Hooked up. Shin breaker. Look past the ring at the thousands and thousands of WWE fans in attendance. Each and every one of them are being entertained tonight. All on the apron, lifting it up into the ring. I, I just can't get over the physicality of this match. It has been absolutely brutal. Around the world on the WWE Network, WWE fans are glued to their sets watching this match. Back suplex. He's bringing it back inside the ring now. Using the ladder as a weapon. Ouch. Setting that ladder up now. Boom, what a forearm. Ooh, forearm to the kidneys. Ugh. Shoulder first. I think the range has shifted. Oh man, low close lock. No M Dar with the upper hand. Just producing an onslaught. You can begin to see it in these superstars' faces. Exhaustion is beginning to set in. They're starting to breathe heavier. This is the time where matches are won and lost. Oh, look at this. Look at the suplex off the top rope. Oh, oh Jesus. Take all the wind out of you. Boom, what impact. Oh, nasty impact. Oh, right to the throat. See here. Hung up on the second row. Breaker. Oh. Can't break in the midsection. Some serious damage to the arm being inflicted here. 
Charlotte Bate just too fast for him. Yet another counter. It's like they're both somehow one step ahead of each other. DDT! Well, that's one way to climb a ladder. Looks like setting up for a suplex. Looking to finish things off. Here's the setup. Oh, that was just malicious. Insulting. No darn position. Running in Siguri. It's all over, but the counting. No way Amdar might have just set the end of this match in motion. The ladder is up. Not looking good, guys. Ooh, a nasty shot to the throat. The Scottish Supernova not sure on confidence or offense. He's mixing precision and physicality with his attacks here. Up the ladder goes. A oh, harsh man. impact. Double smash! Bad spot for him to be in here, guys. You can sense it. This crowd is on pins and needles. The WWE Universe is ready to erupt. Are we close to the beginning of the end? He's playing with him now. Setting up again to the back of the neck. Scottish sickle. one of the biggest upsets we've ever seen. That was shocking, shocking highway robbery. And his opponent is about to blow a gasket and he has knocked out the ref. Sore loser. Yes, yes, a thousand times yes. The man has arrived. The following contest is a triple threat match. Making his way to the ring from Paducah, Kentucky. Weighing in at 190 pounds. Ricochet! This is a man who has traveled the globe, honing his craft, exceeding his own expectations, learning to become the premier sports entertainer in the world. And finally, Ricochet has arrived at the pinnacle of the game. The future of flight.
the American Alpha himself. And his opponents, first from Minneapolis, Minnesota, weighing in at 202 pounds, Chad Gable. Minnesota native has scratched and clawed for everything he's earned in his life. Represented the United States in the Olympics, former tag team champion on multiple occasions. Chad Gable is ready to do big things on the big stage. Here comes Sin Cara. And from Mexico City, Mexico, weighing in at 198 pounds, Sin Cara! Unpredictable, but absurdly fun to watch. This is it, guys. We're ready to get this match going. And on the other side of the ring, there's the one and only Ricochet. About as close to a real-life superhero as any WWE superstar could ever be. These competitors have been unloading on each other since the bell, just looking for that window of opportunity. And now might be the time to seize the moment. Now's the time to keep the pressure on. These superstars must be feeding off the WWE Universe. This place is starting to rock. Ooh, what impact. And Gable's feeding off the WWE Universe. Strong impact from Ricochet. Ouch. Ooh, well measured. Face first with a waistlock takedown. gives competitors so much to consider, so much to be on the lookout for. What are some of the hazards? Well, you never know when you're going to be blindsided or which opponent will try to jack you up next. Allies become enemies at a moment's notice. A competitor needs every ounce of situational awareness they have if they're going to survive this. you got to check your chin. Connected on that. the arm. Great way to break down your opponent. Monkey flip. And he's heading back in. Oh, kick right to the gut. Look at Chad Gable here. Chad Gable doing a great job of turning that around. Oh, shit breaker. from Chad Gable. Look at Chad Gable here. And look at the quickness by Ricochet. Look at how Sin Cara electrifies WWE. Great reversal. Here we Perhaps he's thinking the ring can't contain what he has in mind here. Wasn't expecting that. Of the neck. 
Not a good spot to be, guys. This is terrible. Oh, and he slammed his face right into the barricade. Downward spiral. Takedown. Oh, the knee just being torn apart now. And here we go now. Elbow drop. Sin Cara just too fast. Got him caught. Into a dragon screen changer. Chad Gable doing a great job of turning that around. This is a big risk. Will it pay off? Uh-oh. Oh, my God, what a move. Ooh-wee. Right across the face. Dangerous situation here, guys. Downright treacherous. No, another the pin. Oh, my God. You can't teach the type of tenacity we're witnessing here. Unreal. This could mean trouble. He's going for it all. Are you kidding me? 630! Good luck getting up from that. Can Gable pull through? Doesn't have something big planned here. There's the quickness. Setting up. Lock up to the top rope. He's going for the pin. A kick out, and he almost had him. Close call. Schoolboy pinning combination. Oh, maybe not. That was nasty. So precise. Ricochet hook for the Northern Lights. There it is. Well, well it's over. Wait a second. Yet. Oh, stomping away. He's in big trouble. Perhaps looking to take the action to the outside here. Big boot. Back now inside the ring. Ricochet striking at exactly the right time. The advantage is squarely in his corner. And the end. 
instinct from Gable on display. So quick. When you look at this, it looks like they both did their homework heading into this one. Drop kick! Great athleticism. He's taking it up top. Now that's eking out a win. Let's not overcomplicate things. This business is simple. It's all about wins and losses. And it sure looks to me like somebody has figured that out.